I'm Chloe, and this is Katie and Sam, and we're on KTV at Klinger Middle School, Bucks County, PA. Today we're here to learn about new advances in technology and education for classrooms. We want to show you why you should attend PNC. Um, have you ever attended PNC before? I think this is my seventh time here. Why do you attend PNC every year? To learn. This is the place to learn for educators. We come here, we like congregate together. Look at this, behind you, it's insane. It's the happening place to be. And you learn new technology to bring back to the students so they can be like, yeah, we want to learn more. And then it's great. This is uh, my fourth time attending PNC, four straight years. Would you recommend coming to PNC? Oh, absolutely, it's a great event. Uh, for educators, learn about up and coming technologies, learning about how people are using uh, various technologies uh, to really help kids learn in an engaging way. I would just add that PNC is just, it's really a great um, conference, but really what makes this conference special is that it's educators from all over the state, and I really think, you know, it's these three days that we have here, we have the best educational technology related um, administrators, teachers, students, all here in one place. So it's a great place to be and, and learn. Sure, we're with Blast Intermediate Unit 17 and we provide support services for school districts in Pennsylvania um, and four counties, uh, Bradford, Lycoming, Sullivan, and Tioga. That's where our name Blast comes from. Um, and we're uh, highlighting some of our hardware services, our software services, um, our website design services, and, um, and then we're bringing people into our booth with our, uh, our photo booth. We're uh, letting people come in and take some pictures and have a good time. These chairs look very interesting. Can you explain how the design will benefit kids? Sure, Katie. So my name's Josh Kirst, and I'm the principal ergonomist for the company that makes these different types of seating. Um, the company's called Safeco. The whole idea is to create a more active, more mobile classroom. Um, what I'm on right now is called the MOGO, and it's really a way to give you an upright, active position. We all know that we want to be more active, we want to sit less and move more. In the classroom having sort of active activity permissive learning options uh, gives uh, a chance to learn better. It actually for teachers provides uh, better classroom management. Uh, at the end of the day uh, kids feel better, they actually perform better. Thank you. Um, how do you feel your work can change education? Well I think both as an author and a speaker I hope that I have an opportunity to impact students and teachers and schools in terms of looking for innovation, trying to create conditions and culture where students can really put their voice into their learning. How can students be responsible for their own learning? I think through creativity and innovation and what you're doing right now, this, this opportunity for practical application makes so much sense and I think we need to make sure that students have their voice in all learning design. I'm Pete, and I'll see you next year, even though my name's Tom. It's okay though, just come next year. <laughs>